In this tutorial video, we will use the intelligent AI tuning feature to show how the space mapping function is used to optimize the filter. The demo use case will use a filter order of six and has two transmission zeros. Users can refer to the other intelligent AI tuning video part one in the link below to get more information. The link will also show you how to set up the connection with HFSS with some key parameters, such as physical parameter mapping and boundary value. It will also review the simulation setup and review the steps needed to configure some critical parameters such as trial modification, max changes, and convergent criterion. Most of the setup parameters are the same as seen in the Intelligent AI Tuning video part one. The only difference is the iteration pass. The iteration pass is defined as the number of times the actual simulation is run. For example, if you fill in five, then it means the simulation will be run five times. For the space mapping method, the minimum iteration pass is the number of initial training cycles for each coupling coefficient, plus several cycles of optimization, which depends on the complexity of the model. The number of initial training cycles is the main coupling number, plus the sequential coupling number, plus the transmission zeros number in the coupling matrix. Therefore, the iteration pass will be 6 plus 7 plus 2 and add 7 cycles of optimization. To simplify this in another way, this value is 2 times the filter order plus 1 plus the transmission zeros number. For this demo use case, based on the golden matrix, there are 6 orders plus the 2 non-symmetric transmission zeros. Once these parameters are set, the procedures are the same as seen in the Intelligent AI Tuning video tutorial series part one. After setting up the HFSS analysis properly as a first step, you then click Done. The Symmetrics app will call HFSS to run the initial iteration. Then click the Extract matrix to make sure the extracted result is accurate. Once all parameters are set, Click Start. The Symmetrics app will then start the automatic run process. This concludes this tutorial video. For more questions or a demo, please contact us at support at Thank you for listening and happy tuning.